all right we're actually just doing one room here and it's a frise carpet and he's shaking the spray up get ready to this could be so it's just, just a small room so we're just going to show the whole free spray and everything and she could stay back a little ways from that just lightly spraying we don't get the carpet soaking wet just damp enough that the bonnet can do its thing Well, we figured to make a video today. We did a bake the other day, but we couldn't make videos in there. It was inside of Walmart, and it was... It was just too inconvenient to video, yeah. Yeah, it was a real tight, confined area with lots of people. And, and it made a neat video. The carpets came out really yeah, And nice, also, turn on a video camera when you're behind the counters in a bank. It may not no, be so cool. It's probably not cool. <laughs> Although it might be. We didn't even ask. No, we just avoided the whole deal. Oh, before I forget to say it, because this isn't going to take too long, I'll put links in the video description for the machine and uh, anything else I think that might be interesting for you. And uh, so check there. All right, it smells good in here. It smells like green apples. Green apples. <laughs> we all know what that means. All right. And on this carpet, we're just using like a. Uh, about eight ounces to sixteen ounces per gallon of the uh, with the water. Free spray is not very thick, not very heavy. Now some of this maybe uh, isn't going to respond too well. You never know. This carpet's kind of getting older. And we're using an old good old glad pad for those of you that wonder. Yeah. Now be careful on these. Some people. Uh, that driver that we're using to, on the ore is actually uh, fairly old. We've had it a long time and used it on hundreds of jobs. So when we first got these, we were using this pad driver and telling people, oh, they're great, the pad drivers don't tear the pads up. Well, it turned out that wasn't 100% true because our, our pad driver, our pad pad driver our teeth are, our pad driver yeah, they're worn down. So if you've got a newer machine, then be careful what pads you put on your pad driver because they uh, they can get ripped up a little bit. And the Velcro, a lot of people use, it, it's, it's okay, but you're going to have to keep replacing the Velcro. So, And you need to glue the Velcro strips on because the adhesive will come off once they get a little bit damp. So it's kind of a pain. If you want the best experience overall, if you have a new machine, just use the Orc bonnets for a while. And then over time, you can start incorporating other ones. Try to hold this over. So. Oh, I'm going to go over You're going this way? Yeah. All right. You must have stay right where you're at. You're right in the action. It's kind of dark back here. I think uh, from just looking in the viewfinder and looking with the naked eye, there's a, there's a, the camera boosts the uh, light and everything, so it's uh, exaggerating some of the, some of the contrast is being exaggerated, so. You're not getting a really 100% true picture of what's going on. Back up over here a little. You can stand over here now. Yeah. Right in front of the machine. This is what we kind of refer to as a mini, a minimum. Oh, and we're On jobs to like this, we just charge a certain minimum price, uh, and if it's one room or you know something small, we have to charge at least that, or else we can't. Uh, it's not worth our time. And to we're kind of sorry we're not making more videos because people like them, but we just, well, uh, we've done this to death. And so. also, it's winter time, and most of the places we're going is dark out. It's really bad lighting conditions. It's really hard to get a good video out of any place. So well, we, we've done so many videos that. We just want to shoot them here and there. Oh yeah, we're kind of burned out on making videos all the time, so. Oh yeah. We just time. make one every once in a while just to put something up. But, just, uh, just to entertain people. Yeah. The truth is, we just like to go out and work. Yeah. For it's a lot part. faster. If I wasn't shooting this video, I could be out sitting in the car listening to the radio. And we don't like shooting those 20, 30, 40 minute videos. That's not our No, thing. that's something we've kind of been 
see, we watch videos on YouTube a lot too, and if we're getting real, there. If they're real long, we shut them off. After yeah, we don't. If a video is seven minutes, so. if a video is over ten minutes, it's really hard to find the time to want to watch it because it's uh, it gets kind of like you've seen uh, thousands and thousands of these videos over a period of time, and they're all the same after a while. So we kind of get the idea that what we're doing it can be kind of boring if you yeah if you're watching it every single day. So, yeah, there's a lot of a lot of cleaners that we used to watch religiously, and we oh, just don't watch them anymore. Oh, if you've never seen us before, you need to join our groups. Yeah, I'll put links in the description. But the uh, VLM Carpet Painters Lounge. And we have an Orc Orbiter group. group for you guys that want to be Orc Painters, like what we do. Let me see if I can get behind this side of the bed. I don't know. I won't show back Ooh, there. It's tight. I'll be on in a few seconds, so don't take over the camera. Well, one thing I want to mention to you guys, when we were doing the bank, uh, it was inside of a Walmart, and of course it's a long ways from the front doors of the of the building, and they did not have their own door. They have a fire exit, so they're not allowed to open that. So we were the only ones in town that could really do the job, because the people with truck... We're the only bonnet cleaners in town. Yeah, it had to be during business hours when the bank's open, and so you can't get the carpets too wet, because they have to use the, the carpet. And you cannot string hoses through a Walmart. No, no, it's a, two, 200 feet of hose. No, you can imagine some old lady on a walker uh, tripping and falling on a hose. So, with the liability issues and stuff, we were like the only game in town for that, so it worked out great for us. But uh, anybody who's got one of these little machines uh, has a huge advantage in certain situations. These are also great for trailer houses because we do some of those. And, um, they do not like getting their carpets very wet because it ruins their subfloors. So. Don't let people tell you that these things are, are uh, pointless to own because you can certainly make a lot of money with them, but you've got to choose your niche. Alright, the carpet's looking a lot better. The viewfinder is showing that they don't... They look about like they did on the viewfinder, but uh, trust me, they're a lot cleaner. They're cleaner. We clean these carpets every, oh, three or four months. Yeah. For this, for this person. They're a nice customer and... Uh, they're five minutes from our house, which makes it awesome to come over here. Yeah, it's convenient all the way around. But they're old. They're old. Old Jose. I mean, real old. Yeah. But it's okay. They clean up pretty good. You just kind of hover over it till you think you're done, and then you're done. I can't believe we're approaching the eight-minute mark <laughs> to Are do we? this. We try to make our videos kind of like a Rob Ross video. You guys know who that painter is? Bob Ross? Bob Ross, yeah. Oh, yeah, we'll put a little happy little tree in here once in a while. <laughs> yeah. yeah, if we had the ability to, we would. All right, he's about done. I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, oh, hang on now. Let, let him hear the machine come to grinding off. It won't be long. At least the smoke's not coming out the top of the motor. No. Nope. Yeah, wait, look for sparks, everybody. No, there'll be links to the machine. There'll be links to the groups. If you want to get to know us, we don't do a lot of YouTube no more, so come join our groups and get to know us on Facebook. That's where we're at. Yeah, you we're can there, interact with us. We're there all stuff. the time, so come on over. All right, that's Y'all about it. I hope you guys enjoyed that as much as we did. Until next time, thanks for watching.